Hey everybody, I'm Tyler Dice. This is Tyler Dice Golf, and we are working on our tips from the Masters. This is an approach shot from the Pine Straw. <laughs> Something that's going to happen at this year's Masters. However, they do take good care of their areas around the golf course. And they put a lot of pine straw down. So we're over here, and the pine straw left to the fairway. You want to be very careful on these shots because the pine straw is not like grass. So when you ground your club, the ball could move. You don't want that to happen. So sometimes it's best to just hover the club behind the golf ball like I will on this shot. Now, Hitting shots from these lies, the ball has a tendency to spin a little bit more than normal. So you need to take that into consideration if the wind is blowing up in the air. It's something that Phil Mickelson took into consideration when he hit that, uh, I believe it was a beautiful five iron, uh, you know, from the pine straw. And it helped, win, helped him win the Masters. So, the ball is going to spin a little bit more and you need to be careful that you don't ground your club so the ball topples. You also need to make sure that you get yourself a good footing in here. Because the pine straw could be, you know, a few inches off the ground, you want to make sure that you're actually not standing on a pine cone or a rock or something that you will slip on. So just take that into consideration when you take your stance. So as I set into this shot, I'm also going to play the ball a little bit farther back in my stance as well. So, hovering the club, there's no wind, so I don't really have to worry about the increase in spin. And the ball's going to be in the back of my stance. Check me out. Ball comes out nice and softly and goes towards the hole. This is what we're looking for. You know, we're escaping from the pine trees here off the pine straw. I am Tyler Dice. Hope you guys enjoyed this shot. <laughs>